Hey, good afternoon, guys, from the Lexington Opera House. It's been a very exciting week here. Big announcement came yesterday about these two lovely ladies. Laura Bell Bundy, Emma is with us, who plays L in Legally Blonde. Laura Bell, welcome home, honey. This is fun time for you, isn't it? Of course, yeah. It's a, it's a great week. It's a lot of work. Um, we're putting up the show very fast, but it's really, it's it's exciting to be back home and, and to be bringing Legally Blonde to Lexington. And in a new capacity for me so it's it's pretty exciting first time co-directing a show in theater right because you I heard you talking about you and Lindy Franklin Smith of, of the Lex and how you guys have done productions for 30 years mm -hmm. like in your in your basement living room area too so this is something a little different on a professional level for you yeah somehow we've we've both sort of widened our our skill sets and our and our <laughs> abilities to put on productions and uh, since we were five um, but uh, yeah, it's it's exciting. I think it's I think for both of us, in the last ten years, we've sort of put things in our toolkits that have allowed us to 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 be qualified to direct a right. production. And this is a show that I deeply care about, and I'm 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 excited to be working on again. It's very nostalgic, right. and we're very lucky to have Emma. Yeah, Emma, you said this is such an exciting thing for you to be a part of, especially standing next to Laura Bell Bundy in Lexington, Kentucky. Talk about what you're going to be doing over the next week and working with her. Um, well, we've already started discussing, we went to lunch yesterday and discussed the character, and I think my favorite part so far is just I'm learning so much more about Elle. Um, just hearing about the stories of what was in the show previously and the workshopping process and things that got cut, the reason why some of the things exist in the script. Mm -hmm. It's so much backstory. I mean, it's an actor's dream that I'm getting so much more information to use and create this character again. Well, you've been Elle. You've played Elle many times before. It's a little different getting it from this young lady, isn't it? Yes, I mean, she's terrifying, so it's been really unpleasant. Um, no, this is like a dream. I, yeah. I can't believe that I get to experience this with her, especially like when I was in high school and I, I saw the production in New York and it was that moment where I was like, I, this is what I'm going to do. Like, mm -hmm. she was a big part of why I got sent on this path. And I feel like we're leaving your friend out here. You oh, need yeah. to do some special introductions because he's sitting there I dreaming. I should really do the introduction. <laughs> this is, um, <laughs> you want to say something, Chico? This is Chico. Uh, Chico uh, was the original uh, bruiser in the Broadway cast. Yeah. And um, Chico was at, is a rescue dog, as all of the dogs are, that Bill Berloni works with. Uh, he's our our dog trainer, uh, pretty much the legally blonde dog trainer. Right. And uh, Chico was uh, found on the streets of New Jersey, I believe Newark, um, when he was a puppy. And he was rescued, and he was very incentivized by food, so he was a great dog to train. <laughs> and now he's 12. Wow. Well, he's and relaxing he's so and enjoying being he's an Amazon. so comfortable. But it's so funny because everyone's like, oh, he's so chill. I'm like, he was not chill. <laughs> When I first met Chico, Chico was running around and crazy and, you know, we, 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 he really had to be socialized to people mm -hmm. and the, the very first workshop we did, every single cast member was was holding Chico and and, and Teddy, another dog that we had, and, and just holding the puppies so that they felt comfortable around people. And and then I had to have slumber parties with, with Chico, you know, we slept together. <laughs> Hey, we don't talk about that kind of thing on TV, Laura Bell Bundy. Uh, what we do talk about is the fact that you can see Legally Blonde yourself kicking things off here July 20th at the Lexington Opera House. Get your tickets now. I'm Deanne Stevens. Back to you guys.